Hey, how's it going? For today, I want to do a base remodel. Now I know, I know, we just recently did one. We took our main base over here. It's got all of our mining, it's got all of our crop production, our assembly lines, and we kind of combined it with a second power box that's over here. Now over there, we've got two of our ranches set up. That's making a lot of our different items we need for cooking. We've got our breeding area as well as the condenser. It's kind of nice, man. So we got all of our teams over there, separate from the ones over here. Kind of allows us to have more and then not kind of clutter up one area. The problem is we're getting raided in a very, very weird way. Creatures are spawning in over here, and they're running to that pal box over there. I think that's the one that's actually getting raided, but they're spawning inside of here and kind of causing problems. Now, off camera, I got raided the worst I ever have, man. Had about 30 creatures come in. Half of them were the guys with miniguns. The other half were guys with rocket launchers. I got launched outside the base twice. I died four times. All of our stuff over here is damaged, so it's kind of, <laughs> it's becoming an issue, man. Now, I thought about just kind of putting some walls right here, and then a gate, and doing the same thing right here. Walls and a gate, and then just running in between the gates each time. But it kind of, it's becoming an issue, man. So I just want to get rid of that area altogether, and kind of cap this off right here, and make everything over here our base. So, my plan is, seeing how this area right here is kind of not being used, all we got in here is the bed that we need for sleeping. Totally get rid of this. Break the whole thing down. Get rid of it. We'll put the breeding area right here. Probably keep a little 2x2 two two area right here, and that'll be for all of our storage and stuff, because moving all that would be a pain, man. Put the refrigerator over here, and just put some stairs right here. Now, all this stuff we'll just leave on the ground. We'll set it up in a different area. And then, I want to redo our crop plots, too. And we'll talk about that here in a second. But, condensing all this down might work. Kind of have everybody over here. And we're kind of getting to where we don't need so many teams to do things. I don't need so many guys over here making the, the stone and stuff, right? We're kind of boosted up on that. Same with the wooden stuff. So I think we'll be all right having less creatures. And I want to get rid of all the big ones, man. All the shiny ones are awesome, but they are massive and always get stuck. So that's kind of the plan for today. It's ah, it's going to be a lot, man. I am not looking forward to it, but I kind of am at the same time. Also want to get rid of all these beds. So the bigger ones are nice, but they take up the spot of about four of these small ones. So I want to get rid of all them. We always did good on our sand levels with these, as long as we had the cotton candy out as well for them to eat on. So we're going to kind of go back to that and see how it works out. Now, speaking of crops and food, the main one we're using now is the salad. You get 84 on the nutrition and then 11 on the sand, which is pretty good. You also get a bonus to their work speed while they eat it. I found a new one that I want to do, and that's going to be pizza, man. Pizza does 184 on nutrition. And then 23 on the sand, so over double on each. It also makes them work a little bit faster. And then it also increases their ability to stay fuller for longer. So it'll kind of make it to where they eat less, but they get more nutrition from each bite. So they're not over here eating all the time. Now they're super simple to make. Totally forgot that the kitchen upgrade gives you new foods that you can make. We got the chicken carbonara, or not chicken, but the regular carbonara. And then you've also got the pizza. I was looking about doing this because it's super simple, man. You got the eggs and the milk are made in the ranch. And then the flour is just the, uh, the wheat crop plots. Junior. I'll tell you what, let's pick these guys up. Get them out of the way. And the, the pizza's not too much different, man. You got the berries and then... Let's sort this. Actually, we need that guy down and that guy down. Let's get rid of you and you and you and you. We're going to keep out the loop mons for building. There we go. Now everybody's out of our hair. Holy crap, dude. The, uh, <laughs> the big guys get to be a little bit too much. But for the pizza, it's super simple to make as well. All we've got is the wheat we need for the flour. Berries we can make inside of the ranch. Tomatoes, a couple crop plots. And then the milk is made inside the ranch. So I think two of the wheat and two of the tomatoes. That should be plenty for making this. Maybe even just one of the wheat. And then, well, we want some wheat for making our... Our cakes as well. So yeah, two of the wheat, two of the tomatoes, and we're good to go, man. Super simple. Not too bad. So we'll see how that kind of goes. If anything, we could always fall back to the salads again. Not a big deal. Now, as far as setting stuff up out here, I think we'll kind of leave this as the starting point, right? We got a ton of wood in here, a ton of stone. A lot more stone here. Holy crap, dude. I didn't realize we had so much. And then we got a little bit of wood here. We did have more, but I made a ton of it up for charcoal, and those guys are over there. They were making it into the carbon fiber. One's there sleeping. Where's the other guy at? 
He's up there slacking off. The way that it goes, dude. And yeah, they still got a little bit of that left to make. So it's not too bad, dude. Not too bad. I think it'll be better once we get it kind of all condensed down anyways and everything down on the ground. Maybe they won't get stuck on so much stuff with these smaller creatures either. But I was out doing some exploring. As you can see, I've got a ton of eggs to hatch up. We'll do that before we start building. And then one of the things I found, too, is a blueprint. And it's for a pump action shotgun. It's a schematic one. I'm hoping, really hoping, that's going to change the durability on it, as well as maybe a boost in damage. So the main problem with this one, the attack is fantastic, man. It does very, very well, but it's only got 150 on the durability. Breaks super, super fast, man. If that can be double, ah, uh, dude, our life would be saved, man. It'd be so much better. Drop off the lettuce in there. So we got one huge egg, and then a bunch of the large ones, too. See if we get anything good out of these real quick, and then we'll kind of start on our day. I want to build the shotgun before we start breaking everything down. Oh, it's an ice version of one of those. Interesting. Okay, well, didn't expect that. I kind of like how there's the desert and ice version of all the normal creatures. Another one of those. That makes the high-quality cloth, right? Nice, we need some more of those. I think we need three more total. Those are the guys that will help out with our weight once we get the saddle unlocked. That's like one or two levels from where we're at now, so not too far away. Another one of those, not really interested in them. They bounce up and down a lot whenever they're flying, man. Oh, there's a nice version of those. Interesting. Didn't know that was a thing. And one more of those. Nice, I think we're only like one away. Then once we get these saddle made, we'll have a full inventory of those guys. So it's not too bad, man. Let's see what we need for our shotgun real quick. I think we just need one more parts. I think it's some of the polymer, right? It is. We're, sh <laughs> we're shy too on the polymer. I was up in the snow area, though, in between videos. Up uh, over here, trying to get some of the pure quartz, man. Need a lot of that for the circuit boards. So once we get rid of our other our other base over here, that'll free up one. It might use that over here as a temporary teleporter because all the quartz I've found have been like right around this area and there are zero teleporters anywhere nearby. Now I know that one doesn't seem like it's far away, but that is a massive mountain to climb up and down every time we go to it. So if we put it here, that'll give me a chance to farm up a bunch and then we can always demolish that one and use it as a kind of like a, a satellite base anywhere we want to go. Like over here, there's no teleporters either. So we'll see, man. We'll see. It'd be kind of nice. Our other one's set up if you didn't know over here by the Cinemoth Forest. And I thought about getting rid of that one and using that as our, kind of like our, our satellite teleport area, wherever we want to go. But it's, I don't know, man. We'll have to see. It's kind of nice having it right there for doing our metal runs. Let's go ahead and take this. Cancel that. Need you guys to make up just two of these, please. Should go fairly fast. And then I'll start breaking down all this stuff overnight. I want to do that wall there, right there first. Hopefully that'll kind of stop the raids from happening. Let's get this out. There we go, man. Drop those in there, and let's go ahead and leave our blueprints down here. Shouldn't take him too long. I should probably put Robin in our inventory. Help out with building a ton. Let's go ahead and... Wait, do I need the blueprint on me? I thought I had to just be in our inventory. Like, the storage. Interesting. Oh, let's go ahead and grab it again. I thought with the... The blueprints... For the armor... As long as they were in here, we could build them. Does it really matter? I wish the range on this thing was a lot longer. Alright. What of you? So we got 60 on the ingots, 40 on the polymer, 80 on the carbon fiber, and 5 on the ancient parts. Start production. That'll give them something to do, keep them busy. I do like how they, they work all night, right? For the loop mons? Or the loop moons? I keep calling them loop mons. That is gonna take forever, dude! Okay, well, maybe it'll be done by the time we're done. <laughs> totally rearranging the base. Let's grab Robin real quick. This one. Change it out for the cats. Drop off our blueprint, and let's go ahead and sort this wall out real quick. And then, like I said, overnight, I'll go ahead and break everything down. 
Yeah, I think just a 2x2 two two right here should be fine. We'll probably move the three tables out over here. And then put the... Probably put... Refrigerator right here. And maybe the kitchen back on this side. And that should be good, I think. Might put some walls over it too. Small little building. Tiny, tiny little building. We'll see. <laughs> Let's see how it goes. Alright, so... Put this away. Break down this, this... And that. Same over here, give us some room. Now it might not line up perfectly. I can always deal with that off camera some. Let's start off with the gate on this side. Now, normally we're on the finger loop, so we don't need a gate, but if something happens, I don't want to have to go to a teleporter to get back inside my base. I mean, it's a thing, dude, it's a thing. One there. Small gap. Alright, so I'll just kind of put this on the back side for the moment. It's gonna look ugly, but it's just to keep the raids from happening and creatures out while we're building. That should work there. Nice, dude. Nice. Alright, Robin, Junior. Yeah. Buddy, can you build this for me? I don't want you harvesting. I want you... I want you building. There we go, buddy. There we go. Help him out some. Alright, that's done there. Let's put you over here while we're doing the remodel where we're going to put the refrigerator real quick. Let you help out there. Quarter way done. It's, <laughs> it's going to take a while for sure. We'll break this down real quick, and then I'll do the rest while it's nighttime. So we'll get rid of that and that. It's going to be so many resources. Let's get rid of all three of these. We'll move those around. That gives us a flat spot to deal with this. We'll get rid of that and that. Get out of build mode. Let's do stairs. I kind of want to change these over to wood, man. I hate the way that the stone looks. But that'll be... That requires us to move all those, you know? I mean, it's fine, it's fine. Can we do a refrigerator without moving the other one first? We need polymer. Let's go ahead and just break it down. It'll be fine. Grab all this. What was that? Are you guys done? Usually they make that sound whenever they're done with something. Store all that. That's good there. Let's break down the refrigerator. All our food's gonna go, yep, poof. That's <laughs> the way that it is, dude. It's fine, man, it's fine. The main thing is moving those so we can actually just demolish all that stuff. And then build... You. You fit here? Oh, you will. What about with a light on the side? It should. Hopefully that won't be in the way for our storage. Kind of worried about that, not gonna lie. That'll work there. Put Robin over here. Yeah. Yeah. You can build on that. Let's move the kitchen as well. Yeah. Yep, overweight. Alright, so this is done. Let's put all of our food back in there. And here's the carbonara that I was talking about. So you got 129 on the nutrition. The sand is 16. The thing I don't want to use this because of is the... The bonus is for defense. Not really worried about that. Especially here at base. I mean, it might be good out in the field, but it's easier just to have the pizza, man. That's so much more on the nutrition, you know? Drop that in there as well. So that's kind of set here. That's done. Robin's almost done with that. We'll let her build that. And I'm going to go ahead and start breaking all this down. Let's go ahead and pick up Junior. Can we pick you up while you're sleeping? We can't. Put you into the PAL box. Get you out of the way. Put you back out. There we go, man. There we go. Go sleep over there. That'll work out. All right, man. <laughs> I've got a lot of, lot of renovating to do. I'll probably leave the power until the shotgun's done. Is it done? It's not. Okay. There's gonna be a few minutes on that. But when that's done, we'll go ahead and relocate this as well, just to try to get everything out of this area for the breeding. Now, I'm hoping to put the breeding area right up against this, and we might build a couple walls on the sides and a small roof. Leave this side just totally open. That might work out. Let's see, this thing needs to get moved, though, first. There we go, that should work out a little bit better. Might be kind of cool, just a very small building to have all that stuff in. Alright, so most stuff is broke down. I've got the beds, 
Everybody just woke up, so good time to do that. And I think we're done over here. Nice, man. Nice. Kind of excited. Let's take a look at this. So the old one was 220 on the attack, 150 on the durability. The new one, 275 attack and 250 of durability. I was hoping it was going to be higher, but I mean, it is what it is. It's not too bad. The better attack is definitely, definitely going to help out as well, right? But mainly the durability. Ah, uh, dude. It'd be super expensive to, <laughs> to repair it, though. That is the only thing. So up here is kind of set. Let's go ahead and build a small little roof over this. We'll leave this for later. Oh, we're out of spots. I want to sell that. Let's go ahead and just put it over here for the moment. Let's do a small amount of building on this. Not too much. Let's do... Let's go ahead and do stone, too. Might as well. That way we don't have to worry about it catching on fire. Oh, we can't. That stuff's in the way. I just rebuilt that, like, twice. Make sure we can actually put this all the way around. We're set. Let's go ahead and do... I don't want to do that. I wanted to cancel it. Let's do... The windows. One there. One there. The back side can go ahead and be... Solid wall. And I need to remove these two things. Again. Might just be that. Yep, easy one. Just a repair station. You alright? Going to get some food. Let's build these solid walls. There we go, man. There we go. At least we have a small, <laughs> a small little bit of a base. And we'll do a small little roof as well. One there. One there. Might not need that on the front. We'll have to wait and see. And then let's do our stone roof. We have to build it from the bottom up. Again. Is it broken? It's still broken, isn't it? That's fine. We'll do it this way. Thought about doing a wood roof, but I mean, it kind of works out. At least it's safe now and we don't have to worry about it catching on fire. That's the main thing. I'm not sure if all your stuff gets destroyed if that happens. I'd, I'd kind of like to not find out. The, uh, the roofs are super buggy, man. There we go. Nice, dude. Nice. Alright, what do we have for... Lamps? Not that. Lighting. We got a chandelier. We got some wall lamps. How does that look in here? Maybe build... Two of them? One... Hello? Place a ceiling. Junior, that is a ceiling! Okay. We're gonna do the wall ones. <laughs> That's fine. We'll do... Two of them. Well, just one. I think one will be fine. Let's do two. I want it to be very bright in here. One there. One there. And we'll do... One here. And one there. Now we should be able to go ahead and break down this. And that'll freeze up some space there. There we go, man. There we go. Now we'll do some decorating later. Well, let's just do it now. With the... The plants and stuff around this. Make this one area look nice, you know? Where is the ones for... The walls? This. Put some grass growing on the outside. I like how this doesn't require it to be built, you know? It's like just there. Maybe we'll do a piece right here as well. Cover up the windows a little bit. There we go, man. There we go. Looks a lot better. We'll do some on the inside, too. I think that's all that we need is right... It's just those. We need the other repair station. Put you there. Is that the only... Oh, we got the medicine one, too. We don't ever use it. Let's not build it, because... Well, we'll build this one. We got the other one coming up here soon. The electric one. And then in the corner in here, we'll go ahead and put down some of the... plants, just to make it look nice inside. Do this one. Do one there. 
One over here for Junior. There we go, man. There we go. Make the place look nice. That should be enough light on the inside. If not, we can always put some more lights. And what if we do... Will these go right here without a wall? I don't think so. I kind of like it open, but it looks weird. Let's let's do some testing real quick. And remove these. You can't. It needs that for support. Okay, that's fine. We'll leave it like it is. Not a big deal. So that's our little workshop, man. That should be fine for stuff for now. Let's see if we can put out our ranch over here. Not ranch. Sorry, we need the, uh, the breeding area. A lot smaller than I thought it was. Junior! Please get out of there, buddy. Turn it a little bit. There we go, that'll work there. Nice, nice. Now, I saw somebody else put some of these on the inside of the breeding area. Kind of a neat idea for space. Gonna do the same thing, see how it works out. Where is... the beds? Here we go. So, one... two... Three. We'll do four. Do four on this side as well. Kind of weird how you can put those in here, but very good use of your space. So that's eight of the beds that we need. <laughs> that's not too bad, dude. I like it, man. I like it. Now, can we put the, the plants and stuff on the outside? Not that we want to, but kind of curious if we can. Oh, you can. Kind of put those anywhere. I like that, man. I like it. All right. So, there's half the beds. Let's break down these other ones. We're going to be overweight here very fast. Let's get in the middle. So we can pick up all of them. Main thing is going to be, I think, wood. We'll drop that off over here. We can actually move around. Nice, dude. Nice. All right, so... That's the main part of our base right there that we need, is the breeding. Let's go ahead and grab our cakes, move them over, chop off our resources first. Store all that in there. I like how that's all kind of condensed right there, too. Open you. Make sure nobody's coming for us. <laughs> Look, dude, you never know, man. You never know these days. It will take all the cakes out of here. 65 cakes. I've been busy, man. Been busy. Getting those crafted up. Let's get rid of you. And I'll tell you what, we need the other beds. We'll come over here for them, instead of building them out of our storage. Robin's like, where are you going, man? I always do that. Close. Close. There we go. So the condenser, we could do the condenser... ...right here. Kind of on the side. Turn it this way some. Oh, we can't. It has to be this way. Put it right there. That'll work. So, for the crops... I still want to do those over here on the side, I think. Or should we have those over here by... This. The crop plots. Let's do them right here. Because that way they're going to come straight out, and it's not going to look weird. If we put them over next to this, it's going to come straight out from here. It's going to be like a triangle gap back there, where nothing's at. The food... The food might get moved as well here soon. I'm thinking... Maybe just over here by the pal box. It's kind of in the middle. Let's move that now. Again, I wish there was a bigger feed box. I don't know why. I just wish that there was. Put you there. Grab all the stuff. Can probably make that ourselves. I'll, I'll end up moving this again, but for right now, we'll just put it right here. They should be almost done on that. 
All right, so for food, let's do the pizza. And then spread these out. Not that. And do it like that. So this is done, right? Oh, they're just doing the beds. So there's the cakes. They are safe. Our cakes are safe, man. If you didn't know, put the cakes in here, the timer stops. So it kind of works out for storing them in there. Just, just curious. Does other foods also stop the timer? Oh, you can't. You can't put them in there. Interesting. So that's only for cakes. All right, is what it is. All right, so that's kind of good going there. Let's do our crops. So we're going to need two wheat. We'll just start it right here. Get it nice and tight and lined up. And then we also want to do two tomatoes. And that's good for the crops. Now we got our mill we need to have out as well. I think we'll just have that right here in the front. And that's it for our food. That's not too bad, dude. Now, I still want to put two of the ranches if we can. All we have left to set out is... ...production lines... ...in the ranches. Why do we have so much more space? It's because of the crop plots, right? We had so many of those out last time. Production lines we might still do over here on the side. I kind of want to do it the way I did last time. It takes up more space doing them long ways along this. Trying to think, should we move the hot springs over there? Let's leave that as it is for right now. Let's do the... This is nice and flat for the... ranches over here. Let's do the ranch on this side. Is that under PAL? I always forget where everything is. Just one of these. One should be fine for now. Alright, so that's good there. We'll set up the... What do we need? Milk? I think it was milk and berries? Yeah, milk and berries. So one each of those guys, right? Trying to think about how many teams we're going to need. Might put out something to do multiple things as far as the crops go over here. Try to multitask a little bit. Have to see. And I want to move this too. Maybe this will get moved over here on the side. Put him over there. Infrastructure rights. Yeah, there we go. Put you right there. And where's Robin at? Right there. Building that. Alright, so, production lines. Let's get rid of this one. And then we'll start off with... the spheres. I'll do it this way. Want to leave plenty of room. Actually, let's do it this way. Spin it around. Leave plenty of room so nobody gets stuck. So they build on the opposite side of the robot arms. So I definitely want to leave enough room over there. Buddy, yeah. All the space, man. All the space. Put that one there. And this one here. Spin it around the other way. Is that the same size? They are. So nobody should get back here. They should be working from this side on all of them. And then once we get the other one, we'll set it up probably just right over here. And that'll be out of the way. I'm mean, going to set the other one for right now anyways, for the weapons. Just so that we have it out. Hot springs, I'll move probably over there. And then I need to see how many more beds we need. We need... 
We got 15 total we can have, so... Seven more of those somewhere. And this will be under pals, right? No? Here we go. Kind of in a central location there, so that works out for those. The rest of the beds... I mean, we could do over here by the hot springs, right? Yep. Three there. Three over here. Junior, please, buddy, please! So that'll work there. That's gonna be 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. That's 14 of them out. So much space over there, dude. I think we're kinda good. We'll see how this kinda works out. It might be better just to have the base like this, man. As it is. Are we missing stuff? We're missing something. We gotta be missing something big. We got all the production out. Oh, the furnace and stuff. Okay, there is stuff we're missing. So... Maybe we'll set up a... Not that one, but the other one. Smelting area... Can do it over here by the mine. Look kinda good, right? Is the power set up? What happened to our power that was going? Oh, I have too many things going! I forgot about that! I bet she was almost done with our power, and it broke. That sucks, man. Maybe we won't leave it right there. It's kind of crowded there as it is. We could put the power over here. Next to the furnace. Let's do that, man. Let them build on a, a little bit more, and then I'll get the furnace set up. Right, we got an army out here building, man. Got all the robins out. <laughs> it's a bunch of them. Some other guys, so we're doing pretty well on that. I lost one of the crop plots, had to put it back out there. So that broke, and the electricity. So let's get out... Where's it at? Production. The furnace. Always forget which way this has to be facing, I think. Is it this side? That has a bigger opening, that has... a smaller opening. Let's do it, I think, this way. I think. I think. Possibly. Maybe. We'll leave some room, because the dragons will be over here. So we'll do that there. Now we want to do the improvements as well. That's going to be under... Other. Cauldron behind it. We could move that back further. Let's do that. Put you right there. Cancel you. And then this back out this way once they all move. They built so fast, man. Alright guys, out of the way now, out of the way. We got one more thing, but you're kinda in the way. There we go. Everybody will come back. <laughs> that's the way that it goes. Alright, so we need one more of the infrastructure things. And that's gonna be this. And that'll be back here for the... Wood production. That's good. That's good. All we're missing is the power, I think. Oh, we need the silo, too. Ah, oh, dude, should've put this on the side. We can put it back here, it'll be fine. Is there a front of this? I don't think so, we'll put it right here. And then we'll do power, I guess, just over here on the side. They do the wood from that side. Let's put the power over here. We can always move it. Not a big deal, man. Super fast for him to break that down and move it. I think we're set. Let's double check. So we got production. We've got... All of this. All of that. The pals. We got the ranch. Egg incubator. Need to have that set out. And the statue of power. Let's do this over here. Right next to... The breeding area. Logical place for it. And then the statue... I just put out here in the middle. 
Let's do it. They're right here should be fine. We can always move it. Not a big deal. Super fast to move it. So much space over here, dude. Holy crap, man, there's a lot of space. So that's all done there. Is this backwards? I think that's the right way? I don't know if they blow the flames into this side. Or what? It's always, I don't know. <laughs> always get kind of confused on that one. We do need some more lights set up, though. Let's pick up all these guys before something happens and they start planting stuff. You and you. We'll save all of them for later. Alright, so we got two of the loot mons. Power production. Refrigerator. I want small guys for doing stuff, not big ones. We're gonna have... Regular turtle. One deer. I don't want her for planting. She plants fast, but way too big, man. Who else does planting? You do planting, you do harvesting, transports, and handiwork. They're very small. Let's put two of these guys out, and that'll be for planting and harvesting. See, they're super small, man. So that'll work there. Robin, Junior, over here, buddy. I need somebody for water. These do water, but only level one. You're level one. You're level one. Is there any small ones to do level two on that? You! The gobfin. I need some more of the gobfins. Those guys are pretty close. I want to have two of those outs. I think two of those out. Now you do level two on the fire. I kind of want the dragon out for the fire, though. I think that's all that we're missing, right? Just fire? One is going to be in our inventory. I think it's this one that we're using because it's the highest level. I need to make a saddle for him, too. I was going to do that in this video. That should be good there. So you're doing your thing over there. You're watering this. I want you to water over there, though. Cancel this for the moment. So that's all good there. So they're getting the crops ready. I need another one of the gobfins. We could go grab one of those real quick. How many of the... We got eight of those. Let's go grab one real quick. Yeah. They're not very far. Not you. What? And then we'll get our stuff sorted out with the ranch. Get that kind of going. They should be right down here off the cliff. So, <laughs> it's so much, so much of a mess over there, dude. Holy crap, man. Yep, sorry, buddy. I knew I was going to land right by you. I think. It's right over here, right? Kind of in this area. Let me try to find them real quick. We just need one, and that should be good for our water production. Totally not where I thought they were. They're up further that way. Let's go ahead and test out our shotgun. While we're out. See how it does. This is the new one. Damage is about the same. Headshots are about 150. That's not too bad, man. And then the durability should help out a ton as well, right? That's the main thing was the durability. Junior, is it bad day? Want to see is the clip size the same too? Oh, it's nine. One extra. That's not too bad, man. I didn't think about the clip size being higher. There's some more of the pout oils. Let's go up one more teleporter here. I mean, it's in the name of the teleporter. <laughs> they should be all around here. So, we just need one, I think. Junior. Yep. Causing problems already, man. Are you dead? You are. I don't want to kill him, I just want to tame him. Could use a shotgun, but, again, very expensive to repair. Should be insta-capture because of the, the... the spheres that we're using. We'll get a couple. Might as well, might as well. Never know. We need them anyways. Why are you aiming at the one that's... Yep, not even the one that I'm aiming at. Clumsy one. I want one that does really good work, man. 
That's what I need to do is start getting the guys that I want to keep for like just having one or two around a base. And make sure we get some good ones captured that do a bonus to their work speed and stuff. And get them kind of leveled up. I think that's where I'm kind of going wrong at base with stuff, right? Not having the proper stats on them. It's kind of what this whole game's about is having all that set up for production, right? I mean, your, your pals, you know, your workers. Maybe? We got four more of these spheres left. None have been... good skills. I mean, there's a ton of them. Let's go ahead and grab a couple. Yep, you should be fine. You have an attitude problem. I'll be capturing you as well. Hard skin. Not really one we're looking for, but it's fine. Botanical Barrier, again, not one we're looking for, but it's fine. There we go. That's all of our spheres. Please be one for work speed. Diet Lover. I mean, that's good, man. That's good. Less, uh, less on our food consumption, right? So we'll set him out, and we are set for the moment. Go ahead and get rid of the rest of our other base real quick and get our ranch sorted out. So, for in here... Where's all the new guys? Sorted by the pow deck. A little bit easier. So the one we have out is... Nothing to do with working. Diet Lover, he's good. And all those, again, nothing for... I have to tame some more off-camera. I got a lot of work to do off-camera for that. So, we're good there. We've got how many pals out? We've got 11 pals out. We've got enough room for four more. Let's see who we got over here. And who you want to put in the ranch. So much stuff. So much stuff, dude. Alright. <laughs> now that that is done, let's go ahead and grab... We need a berry one for sure. Let's pick you up. We don't need you anymore. Don't need you. Don't care about that one. I kind of do, but I don't. Don't really want it to fix you out anymore. This one's good for the... coins. The cows, I need to find a better one. And that guy we need for the berries. And that guy as well. That'll get this kind of sorted out over here. We need to come over and trash all this stuff. Is anything in the refrigerator? Little bits. Wait. Wrong way. There we go. And some wood. <laughs> I like it. Alright. Can't wait to break all this down and get it gone. We still need to make one more bed over here. I right, pick you up. Is anybody out that doesn't need to be? Probably only need one of the loot mons out. Need to get a better one of those, man. Or somebody better for our handiwork that only does handiwork. So we're gonna have you out. And you out. And you, and you. And everybody over there to the ranch. And that's the, the cap on the ranch anyways. Four creatures. That should be fine. We'll have to see how it works out. Like I said, if anything, we'll go ahead and... Yellow rights? They're harvesting. We'll go ahead and plant some more of the... The crops. We can always do it over there. We've got a ton of space over there for that. And we can kind of change out what's in... The ranch over there. I need to get better creatures. I need to go out probably next video and just get specific creatures that have stuff for harvesting in base here. Buddy, you, you don't belong up there, man. Look. Making life difficult for everybody. I think we're set, man. I think. Right? I feel like we're forgetting something. Now, I could up this to 20. I might do that in between this video and next one. Just to have more spots here at base for creatures. Let's go ahead and start breaking down our other base over there. Drop this stuff off in our storage. I really like how this is set up, though. Nothing there. We got an egg to hatch. Let's leave all that stuff. We'll get rid of this one piece of wood. It's bugging me. Hatch you. It's a large common egg. Not sure what it could be. Ton of creatures. One of those. What do those things do, too? We got some of those.
think we have like two or three of them. These guys. Not very much. Good on transport. They also do wood and some handiwork. Might change out the loop months for that. I know it's very slow on the handiwork, but... It's better than just having one creature that doesn't do anything. Maybe just change out one of them? I'm sure there's some better ones. I'll look off camera and try to refine that a little bit. Because we're not always here doing building. So that's good. Alright, let's start breaking down this other side here. And get all that gone. And we'll just get rid of this viewing area. We can still set this up at the other base. Pick up these two guys. I kind of like having them out. Slowest walk of my life. Holy crap, dude. It is all done over there except for the wall. Always break that down off camera. Let's leave all of you. Now, I'm kind of thinking about starting to put the wood and stuff in here. I mean, we're kind of short on space as it is. We could. I kind of like it over there, though. I want to go ahead and put some lights up out here. And get that sorted out that we should be able to see fairly easy. I'll put some of them, like, right there. Over here. And then some over there by the hot springs. Almost, man. Almost. Where is... Oh, just the one turtle. I forgot. Thought we had more than just one out. Almost at the box, dude. There we go. Holy crap, dude. Alright, drop all you off. We got some salads left. We'll keep those on us. We'll put some of that... Back in the refrigerator, too. I think we're good over here for foods. Six of the pizza left. We don't need any more of the cotton candy. I think we'll just leave that guy kind of gone. Put those in there for safekeeping. Put these into the box over here. And let's see. We were kind of out of all the stuff for pizza. Let's see if we have any stuff left to build it. If so, we're doing fine on all of our resources, you know? Yep. We can. 76! Why do we have so much? Interesting. Start making it. We'll see if Junior can actually fit inside there. He should be able to. That's why I left this whole one side open, you know? I mean, you're going through the window, but... <laughs> whatever works. Is he actually making it? He is. Okay, cool. Nice, dude. Nice. Alright, let's get some things set up here. Get our hands free. There we go. Let's do some of these lights. I like these, man. They look nice. We'll set one there. We'll do another one right there. Some by the hot springs. One there. One here. Don't want nobody tripping on these stairs going up there to enjoy a little bit of relaxation. We'll put some regular street lights up over here. Do the double right here. That'll work. That's kind of good. That should light all this up. Oh, on this side too. Dude, everyone's going to build, man. That's nuts. It's kind of nice having all those guys doing the same. I don't know, I'm kind of torn 50-50. I like having certain creatures that only do one task. That way they'll always do that one task. But when they're not doing that, it's nice that they'll do other things. So I don't know, man. We'll, we'll have to see how it kind of works out. Let's do these over here. Actually, let's do a different one. We need to do this to match the other side. One right there. We'll do the doubles over here. And then I think that'll be fine on that side. Put this in between the two workstations. And then one over here. Let's build the viewing area just to have it up. Oh, I need a bed, too. I need to put a bed somewhere. So what is that under? Other? Oh, I need this stuff, too. We got that. We got that. We got that. We need this and that. Let's build this one up real quick first. That'll help out with the harvesting over here. Where do we want the flowers to be? It doesn't matter where it's at. 
Dude is in his shell and everything. He's sleeping in the hot tub. I'm just saying. It's kind of messed up. Kind of wanted out to where it looks good. Junior, you're still up on the roof, man. He's got to be on a roof everywhere. We can do the flowers over here. Make it look a little bit better. And let's set out our toolbox. Might just put it right here for the moment, just for looks. That'll help out with our production and stuff. Alright, so the viewing area. I don't know what that was under. Ah, here we go. Pal. Viewing cage. I still wish you could make it a little bit bigger. And we'll just set all of our... same creatures that we had in there. We'll do the, uh, the traders as we get them. I want to collect all the traders. And then I also want to do... some of the, uh... Oh yeah, there's some new guys, too. Up in this area, that are spawning in. They got guns, they got like different guns, not like regular bullet guns. It's got like, I don't know what it is, man. I have to show you, we'll go up there next video and do some exploring. I also want to set up some lights over here for them. We'll do these. Little street lamps. One there. One over here. There we go, man, there we go, wrong button. Wait, what's in the pow deck? Is there a new creature? Oh, probably some of the... PIDF or PDIF, whatever they're called. I didn't see anything new out anywhere. Oh, it's this guy. We hatched. Those two. Okay. Looks kinda cool, man. You know me, I like blue. That looks fantastic! So he does cooling and mining. That one does the kindling and mining. Gathering. And cooling. Interesting. Mining, lumber, planting. He's just too big to be in here. Cooling. All the cold creatures do cooling. I mean, makes sense, right? How big are these guys? That would be good to have here in base. Lumber, handiwork, and transport? Oh, dude. Might need to change out some of our other creatures. Let's take a look. We're at max capacity. Need to put one more bed out. Where is... That guy at him. So who's doing lumber? This guy. Diet lover. Let's do him. We'll see how that works out. Might be good. Had to see. He's kind of a big boy, you know. And then for the beds, we need one more bed. Let's. Where can we put it? That was a thing. That's kind of cool. They're more sleeping inside the, <laughs> the breeding area. I kind of want to not put it back here. We could just do it right there. Let's do it right there. Well, you know what? Let's not mess that up. If we change it in between this video and next one to have more creatures, we're going to have to set out five more beds anyway. So I guess for right now, we can just set it over here. Some people have a bed all over here by themselves. Do we have a robin on us? We do. Yeah. All right, man. Looks like the lights are pretty good out here. We got a couple more we gotta build. I will see you in the morning. I'm gonna let Robin go ahead and do her thing. Finish that, and we might be done for the day. We'll have to see. I'm gonna try to break down that other wall too, if I have time. And then we'll see how it is. It's kind of weird how everything is so condensed now. And we have so much more room in here. I really think we're missing something. We'll have to see. I need to get that loop mod off the roof, man. The guy is doing absolutely nothing. Alright, just coming up on morning. That area is totally back to normal. It's like we were never here, man. I like it, dude. I like it. I'm really hoping I'm not forgetting something major in our area over here. It seems like we still are, but I think everything's for the most part is built. We got all of our little workstations. Let's go ahead and drop off our cement in here. Gold coins. Why are those out of our inventory? Over here. There we go. Drop off our berries in the refrigerator. Not there. Not there. <laughs> Too close, man. Too close. There we go. Drop those off. And throw our stone over here. And that's good there. Nice, man. Nice. Alright, let's sort this out real quick with the viewing area. And I think... What was that? Oh, they're fighting out there. Don't damage my walls because you guys can't get along. I'm just saying. So. You. And you. Please face this direction. 
I still can't actually access you. It's weird. And why does that say repair? Oh, it's from those guys out there? Maybe? I don't know. Let's move them around a little bit. Alright, so that's kind of good there. Put some more guys in there here soon, too, once we get them. So, production. Ranch. Condensing. All of our storage and cooking and stuff like that. I like that small little area. We got our egg hatching. We got our breeding. We got all of our crops. We've got our mill. Speaking of that. Get that going as well. We got the hot tub. It looks very nice right here, man. I like that. We got the, uh, all the beds on the sides. We got the lights. I'll do some more lights over here later, too. We've got our mining area, as well as a crusher. We've got our logging area. That dude has a very large axe, I'm just saying. We got our smelting area. Electric production. One spare bed for somebody. We have a guest over. And then the viewing area. Plenty of room out here to expand if we need to. Ah, dude. Well, not too bad of a day. Kind of a shorter video. Needed to get a lot of stuff done, man. I feel a lot better having everything inside of, like, one base instead of having it spread out. I'll go ahead and up the count on the dinos. Or not the dinos. <laughs> I'm still thinking about Ark. I'll up the count on our pals to 20. Now we can set out another one of the ranches if we need to. If you have some more helping hands. And we also need to grab some of the creatures, man, that are specific to certain tasks for inside base here. Some with maybe diet lover, work speed increase, and things like that. It'll help us out in the long run having just one of each kind of creature instead of having more than one pal doing the same thing. However, we are going to go ahead and leave this one here. Hope you enjoyed the video. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.